What's up guys, Rabbi Brian Jones here from RBJ Creative Studio and um, I bring to you another episode. So today we are doing something about artboards. So first of all, let's head into um, our file, let's go to file, then you go to new and the shortcut for new is control plus N. So this is what you get when you hit on control plus N. So you choose um, the size that you want. For me, I'll go for 20 inches by 20 inches. Then you make sure you you, you check the ad boards here. The moment you check the ad boards here, that's that's the ad boards. That's where you're going to get. You're going to get access to the ad boards. So you hit on create. So this is what you get. You get ad board one as your new um, document. So um, if you want to rename the ad board, you can just come to this side and double click on the artboard one. So I'll name it logo one. Yeah, and and if you want to duplicate the artboard, so you get like two artboards or three or four, you right click on the move to here and there's um, there's an artboard to beneath the move to. So you just hit on the artboard two and this is what you get. So when you hit on the right side, that's this, this plus button on the right side. It duplicates the artboard to the right side. If you hit on the upper part, it duplicates to the upper part. If you hit on the left part, it duplicates to the left part. Yeah, so that is how it works. And if you want to um, space it out a little bit, you just use the move tool to space the artboard out. So you select it like this. Sorry. You select it like this. It is very stubborn sometimes. It can be very stubborn something like this then you just move it to the left side or to the right side then you do the same to this one too same to this one too and you can also do same to this one so you get i mean you get your spacing and everything so this is the ad box that we i mean we opened just now so first of all let's say you are working you are working on a logo so i'll just go in and get one logo that i created just recently so you bring in your logo then you drop it on the first ad board that's the logo one then this is how it works so if you want to duplicate something or an image or a background or a text from the logo one to the um, um let me rename this guy to to logo two and this one to logo three and this to logo four so if you want to duplicate from um the logo one to logo two what you have to do is you hold your alternate then you drag into the next ad board that's the logo two then you leave it like that so automatically you can see it becomes part of the logo to like it, it, it joins the logo two ad board same thing applies to the upper part you just hold your alternate then you drag on to the artboard and that's our same thing to applies to the other artboard so let's say you want to change colors for the logo all you have to do is just after um after doing this you just go to your control overlay then you just select the color that you want to overlay with um for the logo so i have blue here so i just come select that color for the upper part so i just select let's say green deep green or light green any color that you want then i'll come to this guy too and give it another color so you want to present the logo to the client or to your client too i mean in different colors so the client knows what to choose i mean this is how you do it and um let's say you are done with the yeah, with the logo and everything and you want to save them here you come to file then you come to export then you come to add boards to files so you hit on that one then you make sure you choose your destination so here i'll just choose my works and you hit on ok then there's a file name that you might you might want to consider so let's just do it logo or let's say um logo colors logo colors Oh, sorry guys i didn't mean to do this i was just trying to finish with the uh, 
I think I've 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 spoiled the surprise here. But I let it finish. I'll just go back and deal with it real quick. So um ah, I'm sorry, I'm very, very sorry for this. I should have waited a little bit. Okay. So um let's go back to the file to the exports and to the adboards to files and um, this is how it works you go to your works this you browse for where you want to save it then you, let's save it logo new instead of logo because we have already made a mistake and saved the other one so you make sure you you check adboard content only and also check export selected adboards so we've selected all the four adboards and also include background in export then you come to the file type then here for me i want to save it in jpeg so i just choose jpeg here real quick then you hit on export options it, it's going to be like this when you're starting with it so you just have have to hit on the export options then you set your quality to 12 or anyhow you want to do it i want mine in 12 then you include icc profile and also include adboard adboard name then you run it so this is this is what was supposed to happen but i made a mistake and just hit enter and it went on so there's how it works it saves the ad boards one after the other and it, not it notifies you when it's done so you hit on ok then you go to your um you go to your works so this this is where we saved um our work that's our logos so this is how it works so thank you for um, watching the video subscribe to the channel and make sure to um like the video comment if you have any question or any suggestion and um i will see you in the next one bye bye